Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hey everyone. So this time I'm doing a review of an app called called Back in Time. It's a simple backup tool for Linux, just like System Restore, somewhat like System Restore on your Windows operating system. So there are three simple steps you have to that you have to configure. That is, first one is to save the snapshot where. Uh, the directory where you want to save the backup files and what you want to backup and when it should be done so here check this link and here you can download the DB files or you have got yes you have got the DB files and also a repo repo so you can add this and install it yeah and as far as the app is concerned um, here it's very simple to use I'm trying to back up this directory uh, which is there in my home directory it's a folder uh, with my intro so how do we do it first where to save the snapshots so you specify a directory alright I have specified a directory back in time and then uh, you can schedule it if you want or you can do it manually so every five minutes I did it like uh, just for example I used five minutes and then uh, you specify the folder that you want to <coughs> back up yeah you can add the folder and you can exclude exclude the files that you don't want to back up and this well I if the space where it, it is backing up all your data if it gets very low if you it will start deleting the older backups I'll s explain it later and um, yeah I don't know about this one so so once you specify the folder that you want to back up and it will start backing up automatically like I did it yesterday so first it backed up uh, because the original directory had only these three files so it made a backup and then it will check after five minutes because my time was five minutes I my settings as you can see over here it was just schedule like backup every five minutes it will check the original files with the backup files and see if there is any difference and then it will it will make another backup and then I create I created another directory and it made another backup and then I created another directory like over here and then it made an another backup so so if there is any change in the source directory it will start backing up and if there is no change it won't back up anything yeah and I actually didn't understand what update snapshots mean because um, hey, where is this file the folder didn't exist in current uh, yeah 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 forgot that yeah I made one backup over here and then I edited this text file as you can see over here I edited the text file it did not update so I really don't know what that update snapshots mean uh, means so well you can try it out it's really good app and you can even restore uh, you have the restore setting over here so you can restore and you can back up but for that you need uh, root privileges we have if you launch this app with root privileges yes over here back in time root if you can't see it system tools so if you if you launch this uh, app with root privileges you can back up and restore uh, you could use this to back up your home directory if you want you know this is a very nice GUI very simple to use and if you are interested in backing up your data well you can use this app open source for the win assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh